dear brothers and sisters we are on the 12th day in the reflection right and today let us reflect on the parallels between the birth of john the baptist and the birth of jesus in both the narrations we have characters we have a process happening if we look at luke chapter 1 verses 11 to 20 we have angel speaking to zechariah fear from the side of zechariah message from the side of angel how can this be the question placed there a sign that is zechariah being mute and then the conclusion when you come to the birth of jesus you see chapter 1 verses 30 to 38 of luke angel coming to mary fear on the side of mother mary message from the angel how can this be a question but not in the way that zechariah answers this question is different but the same how can this be and a sign that is elizabeth's sign that is your cousin elizabeth she is now with a child then mary's faith mary's response be done to me and then it goes towards the visitation now both this parallels speak about something angel going to two people zechariah mary one person was in the presence of god in the temple he was worshiping god and the other person mary was in her house she was not a priest she was not experienced as zachariah was so many things yet her response was much more greater than zachariah's zachariah was muted and then he received his voice to give name to the child it was a kind of a symbol of everything being muted preparing for the birth of christ but here this side we have again mother mary her response was such beautiful her how can this be was not a how can this be of doubt her how can this be was a statement of faith these two things speak to us about god's revelation to each of us and the difference in the response the angel gabriel comes to each of us in different forms brings the same message to us but our response matters it doesn't matter how long i am in the church it doesn't matter what is my position where i am it matters what kind of faith is there in my heart he was in the high position he was there at the altar offering incense but his response was not to that level hence what you don't be taken up that person is in the choir this person is in reading that person is the sacristan this person is a priest i am nothing no your power and position in the church doesn't depend doesn't doesn't decide your response your response is decided by your inner conviction that comes from within you that's that's what the lord is speaking to us today so hence forth both the childs were born one child was the messenger the other child the savior both the news was brought by the angel both had different response different kind of stories but all was the plan of god hence both no one is great no one is less all are responsible is valuable all our responses are valuable but it's up to us how we respond to god let's reflect let's reflect dear brethren in our own family lives na responsibility of our children 
in so many news that we receive in our lives good news bad news how do we reflect how do we respond yes fear ruling us is insecurity ruling us is anxiety ruling us are we doing things out of disturbance out of insecurities or are we doing it for god with god in god amen